Hey there, my contract with Raw is up after Survivor Series, and I'm looking for some new consulting opportunities. I'm looking for a superstar who's man enough for me to spend my time on, and you're at the top of the list. What do you say? You know, my consulting skills are only part of the package. I've got a lot of other assets that I think you'll appreciate. Well, first we've got to see how this partnership is going to work out before we get too friendly. I want to see what you can do tonight against Charlie Haas. If he beats you, maybe he's the superstar I should get together with. Looks like Stacy might have just found herself a new client. You know, Cole, everyone can use a little career advice from time to time. You know, I've been thinking, maybe I can arrange for a little consultation with Stacy myself. This capacity crowd is ready for the WWE to bring down the house. Michael Cole with Taz at ringside. Oh, man, Cole, I am so pumped up for tonight's show, I can't wait. I got a bad feeling about this match, Taz. Speak for yourself, Cole. I love it when these you know, guys just pound the hell out of each other. It's great. How much can these superstars have left? Can they keep this up? Haas was an academic All-American at Seton Hall University. Oh, and he brings some intense amateur skills into the ring every time he steps between the ropes. This isn't the last time we see these superstars face off. One, two, three. I'm on the edge of my seat after that match. I can't wait to see those. Matt Hardy. He's a Raw superstar. What's he doing here on SmackDown? Well, looks like he's taking Stacy back to Raw. Man, I was hoping we were able to spend a little more time looking at those unbelievable legs. Look at this. They're beating the hell out of Hardy, and Stacy approves. I think that's Stacy's idea of a job interview. Well, look who's back from Raw, Taz. It's Matt Hardy again, and this time he's brought Batista with him. Last week, 
I came to SmackDown to bring Stacey Keebler back to Raw. And I got ambushed in the ring by two so-called superstars from SmackDown. Well, Matt Hardy version one's back. And I've got a message for those two gutless cowards. If you think you're so tough, how about both of you come down to this ring and get a Mattitude adjustment and have a match with both of us right now? Guys, I think you're a little confused. This isn't raw. So unless you've got a valid SmackDown contract, you need to get the hell out of my arena right now. What about Stacy? She's not supposed to be here either. Well, I'm currently in the process of reviewing Stacy's contract, and it might take all night to finish. But believe me, I've got no interest in reviewing anything that you two have to offer. So if you're not going to wrestle in my ring, get the hell out of it. Listen, pal. It doesn't matter who she came to first. It's all about who she comes to last. I've got just what Stacy's looking for, so why don't you just back off? Yeah, maybe you're right. And maybe Stacy ain't worth all the trouble anyhow. This capacity crowd is ready for the WWE to bring down the house. Michael Cole with Taz and Ringside. Oh man, Cole, I am so pumped up for tonight's show, I can't wait. Can you feel the electricity in the air, Taz? Absolutely, Cole, no disrespect to The Rock. But these guys are the most electrifying superstars in the WWE. Matt Hardy's looking to spread some Mattitude to his fans and maybe make a couple of new MFers. Mattitude followers. This match is so good, it's even worth having to sit next to you and watch it. Imagine the tension in the ring, Cole. Well, you could if you actually got in the ring. One, two, three. He gave it all, but his all just wasn't good enough. Did you see that? I think this is starting to get out of hand. You're right, Taz. And what business do these raw superstars have here anyway? Stacy isn't a piece of property. She's a human being. Hey, I saw what happened tonight. Pretty brutal. But you held your own pretty well, I think. I'm taking off now, and I'll be back on Raw next week. If you're in town, you should come to the show. I've got a bra and panties match against Trish Stratus that you're not going to want to miss. If I win the match, 
I might let you play Santa afterwards. That means if you win, you can take a seat in the middle of the ring, and I'll sit on your lap and tell you what I want for Christmas. Wow, that Stacy is one hot little tomato. I think I'm putting her on my Christmas list this year. <laughs>